In this video, we're going to go over how to use the provided MATLAB code that will transform from local to global coordinates for our local stiffness matrices for each element. First thing we're going to need is our angle. I want to use 90. Um, you also need the length, cross-sectional area, and modulus elasticity for each member. I'm leaving them as one for right now. Next, I'm going to define my transformation matrix, which is cosine theta, sine theta, zero, zero, minus sine theta, cosine theta, zero, 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 cosine theta, sine theta, zero, zero, minus sine theta, cosine theta. We also need the, lo um, the local stiffness matrix for any truss member, which is one, zero, minus one, zero, 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 minus one, zero, one, zero, zero 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 i'm going to next want to calculate the inverse of my transformation matrix in order to use it to calculate my element level stiffness matrix in global coordinates which is ea over h times t inverse k local t if i run this i want to see here is our transformed element level stiffness matrix if i change this to 45 you're going to see we're going to have an updated element level stiffness matrix. You need to do this for every single member in your trust system that we're looking at.